Hey, what's up, LP Nation? I'm Landon Dalitzing. I love talking about the news, so let's talk about this manhunt that finally came to an end. 10,000 law enforcement officers were involved with trying to catch this fugitive Chris Dorner. This is an ongoing story right now. For those of you guys who are just tuning in now, Chris Dorner was a former LAPD officer, also an ex-United States Navy reservist. And he is actually the prime suspect of a Southern California shooting. A series of shooting attacks on police officers left four people dead, including two of those being police officers. He is the subject of the largest manhunt ever for the LAPD. It's banned from California and Nevada and also into Mexico. Chris was discharged as a LAPD, but he's saying that the people he worked with in the police departments framed him and wanted him to get out of the task force. There was this crime where a senior officer actually tasered a disabled guy. And this case was brought into courts where Chris thought it was wrong for a senior officer to taser a disabled person. But of course, courts dismissed this case. This case ultimately was the cause of this guy being dismissed from the LAPD. And this is when Chris created a manifesto online, and this is what he said. I'm a man who lost complete faith in the system when the system betrayed, slandered, and labeled me. So this is what he said he was going to do on the manifesto. He was going to go to every officer that was involved with this case, but not only them, he was going to kill their families as well. Until the truth comes out, he's going to slowly kill police officers and civilians. What do you guys think of this story? There is a space rock, which is called an asteroid. Well, it's about to hit Earth. Well, not really, but it's about to come the closest it's ever been to contacting Earth. They're calling this asteroid 2012 DA-14. The asteroid is guessed to be around 130,000 tons, and it can be worth about 200 billion dollars. I really hope that this asteroid lands in my backyard. This asteroid is actually 150 feet wide and it's going to come within 17,200 miles within Earth, which is still quite a distance, mind you, but definitely close enough for me to ship myself. If this asteroid were to actually contact Earth, it would actually cause 2.5 billion tons of force of TNT, which is blast energy. That's more powerful than a B-83 nuclear bomb, which is the most powerful currently deployed in the U.S. military arsenal. Oh my god, Landon, do you think this asteroid will hit Earth? Well, good thing for you, NASA is actually quite confident that this asteroid is just going to go past the Earth. They've been tracking this asteroid since February, planting its course. What do you guys think of the story? You guys should go outside at 2.24 p.m. Eastern Time and just look up, because that is going to be the closest that an asteroid is going to ever contact the Earth. Pope Benedict has resigned as the Pope. Can they do that? Can Jesus just resign as Jesus? He said it was good for the church. It was mostly because of his age. He's 85 years old. He felt like he couldn't do that much at that age. So why be a Pope still? He said that he is deteriorating in strength and the physical and mental demands he wasn't able to maintain anymore. I mean, what are they going to do? He's going to sit down and all of a sudden he needs someone to like put his hand up to like start waving to people? In modern times, the Pope, well, you were the Pope pretty much until you died. Pope Benedict will become the first Pope to have resigned voluntarily since Pope Celestine V in 1294. Do you guys think that the Pope should have just stayed Pope until he died? Even if he wasn't capable of really doing much? Anyways, guys, that's all the stories I have for you guys today. Hopefully I didn't scare you about that asteroid that's going to happen. Let me know what you guys think of any of the stories I've talked about in the comment section below. And if you guys want to read more about any of the stories that I've talked about today, just click any of the links in the description below. I'll see you guys tomorrow.